Hey guys, it's King here bringing you guys a quick review of Conan for the Xbox 360. Hither came Conan, the Cimmerian. Black haired, sullen eyed, sword in hand. A thief, a reaver, a slayer. To tread the jeweled thrones of the earth under his sandaled feet. The story of Conan is he's in a temple looking for gold and jewelry when all of a sudden he decides to destroy this shrine and lo and behold beneath it is actually a dark and evil force that he doesn't realize that he just unleashed on the world. Moments later our hero is actually floating in the ocean missing his armor and not having any idea what he actually did. Along the way Conan will make new friends, do tons of platforming, kill lots of guys and giant monsters along the way. The combat to Conan is actually very simple yet very satisfying and has a lot of variety. The controls to the game are basically God of War in every way. You have your heavy attack and your light attack and your grab button, but you also can use the right stick to dodge and the left trigger to block. If you hit the block button just before getting hit by an enemy, you will see a button that pops above their head for a split second. If you hit that button, you will do an incredibly violent, yet very satisfying finishing move. Where the variety comes in for this game is actually from when you kill an enemy and they drop their weapon. You will always have your single handed sword but you can actually pick up another one to dual weld your swords. You can also have a double handed sword that you can pick up for slower, stronger and more reach on attacks or even pick up a shield for blocking income attacks whether from arrows or from swords. The bottom line is this game has a lot of variety and also of course there are large things in the environment like rocks and barrels that you can hurl at enemies. The game also has a ranking system in place. You can actually open up chests around the world or you can actually do different assortments of things that will gain you XP so that you can have new moves and new combinations. One problem this game does face however is the fact that the AI in this game is not too challenging. It's actually very easy to memorize their attack patterns, even the boss battles attack patterns. Overall, the game is not that hard. Even on the hardest difficulty, I would definitely say it's not hard. Overall, I really enjoyed the combat of Conan. I could see how it could get repetitive to some, but I still really enjoyed it. I can't stay here. Now this game came out in October of 2007. This game is definitely dated when it comes to the graphics department. It's actually bundled with bad textures, lackluster detail. In fact, if I can remember back to 2007, I remember reviews actually saying that the graphics weren't that great on this game even back then. But if you're like me or where you care more about fun and gameplay than overall graphics, it won't bother you that bad. But what makes this game good to me is the combat is fun, there's lots of gore, and makes you feel like the badass Conan from the movies. Overall, you can pick this game up for about 10 bucks. Right now, as of this review, there is a 75% off on this game in the Xbox Marketplace, which actually is a good price so that you can enjoy this 8-hour adventure of Conan for only $3.99. So this is my quick review, I just want to get this out here since I know the sale is going on. This is my quick review of Conan for the Xbox 360. I hope you guys enjoyed it, thanks for listening, and I'll see you guys next time. We have time to kill before we reach those shores, Barbarian.